Today we got bus grease monkey coming in. We got to fix their exhaust on their bus. And uh, you can see them there towards the back following the rest of the buses. Let's see if we can hear them coming in. They have no exhaust right now. Yeah, you can definitely hear that, that old Detroit screaming. <laughs> Alright, we'll help uh, the traffic get by and we'll get them in here. Some modifications I've done to my welder. I've taken a lot of angle and uh, built a tray for it to sit on. Took all the original casters off of it, set it down on it, and put these off-road casters, made it a little wider so it's more stable. So I can get it outside and wheel it on the rocks a lot easier for jobs like Scott's. My safety splints on nighttime mode. One, two. <laughs> come on, boy, come on. Must be somewhere. Yeah. It may have been just grouped too far down on the welder coming out of oh, it. Okay. I'm gonna hold it up a little. The pipe needs pushed up, it's drooping. There you go. Okay. That's touching now. Is that where you want it now? Yeah. I'm going to put another tack yep. on that should be good yep. until we tear it down. This is a custom built exhaust tip that we made from a stack. We cut it down, beveled it, and turned it into a tip for Scott. Fits him. Well, at least if he dyed his hair, it doesn't do the face recognition. He rolled it that way a little bit, Scott. Okay. It must be related to like a moth or something, because I always want to look at it. <laughs> I do too, I can't see anything right now. Little hand. Can you hold that ratchet? Yep, I got the ratchet. 
have the extension. 